Welcome back to today's Premier Experts. I'm your host, Ray Perez. And today, I have a special guest, Luis Izquierdo from My Financial Educator. Welcome to the show, Luis. Well, thank you for having me. Ray. No, thank you for being here. So uh, I, I want to I wanna start off always by kind of getting to know what a financial educator is. I mean, I know there's a lot of finance people out there, but kind of share with us a little bit about is it what that you do. Well, um, I try to find the results, Ray. I'm not your typical uh, financial educator out there that's always looking out for the quick buck and really not offering the best, pro the best products available. So I'm actually looking, and my niche market is to work with entrepreneurs and, um, and their small business, owners. small business owners. And what I do is I try to help them. I'm like the, the, the backside of their business because so many entrepreneurs and business owners are so worried about growing their business that they really don't have time to focus on their personal or business finances. <laughs> I, I know exactly you know what, what that's like right. being a business owner. And, and I've realized, I've done a lot of study and a lot of uh, looking into it where I've learned that, unfortunately, for business owners out there, out of... 100 uh, employees that they may have, only 13% of them actually run the business for them. And, and I know that that stress level must be killing them because you can't just get rid of someone to have to retrain them again. It's just so much money. Yeah. So what I try to go in there, and I try to be their coach on the financial side. Got it. Because they all need that. They need, some, they need a coach for everything, but this is the most important. And when it comes to their personal, it's even more important. Because now they're not, they can't just focus on their business. They have to worry about getting home and taking care of the financials at home. You can't just leave it amongst your wife or the kids or whatever. You have to work after work. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So I try to go in there and I try to tell them, look, focus on your work and let me do the other part for you. Got it. You got understand? It. Yeah, I mean, I, I always, when I'm coaching people, and I, I always tell them to fo there's time to work in your business and there's time to work on your business. But I never really sat there and considered there's time to work on your personal finances outside of your business. Correct. Because for, at least for me as an entrepreneur, my business is my life. Like it, it's mixed in between. And like my profits for my company and then I just have my profits personally. But I, ha I, don't, I don't even really take that much time to sit there and set up all my personal finances. And uh, I know that's something I should be doing. So what you're saying is you come in and you can help someone like me, like basically do all that for me? Correct. Yeah, exactly what I do. So I'm actually, I'm, your, I'm, I'm like your, your, your consultant, okay? I mean, I understand that it, it, it's, it's mind boggling because you, you have such a great success in your business and sometimes you look back like you were saying, you kind of have to put everything together like a sandwich. Mm -hmm. And you know what, sometimes you're not really in the mood to come back from a hard days of work and, and, and start working, and on start your working again. And, and, and I understand that and, and that's why I decided that my niche would be that, the business owners that really need help, you know, they will look for it. Yeah, you ha sure. I have to reach out and and help them out, and and I've had a lot of results where the the business owners are telling me, "Thank you for calling me." I mean, I I didn't know there was someone out there that would do what you do. Now, now mentioning that you do you do some live events, right? You do right. networking groups right. and you speak at events and kind of educate business owners, and you actually reach out to them, invite them to these events, right. so not only can they learn a little bit about what you do, but they can also network with one another, right? Can you share a little bit more about that? Well, see, I I, I start to think, how can I reach out to more of these business owners? I I know there's a lot of networkings in the area, but nothing like I bring to the table. I'm not just looking to to tell you what I do. I'm here to connect different uh, business owners and entrepreneurs together that, right, to refer each other. And, and I tell you that most of my business now is based on referral. I don't have to do any co Because you've created a network. I've created that network. And, and it's just so amazing how these entrepreneurs are like, man, we're so glad that you called. You must be as busy as we are, but you're making the time to do it. And I say, well, it's the only way that I can really give back and be of service to you and not just show you what I do because that's not what I'm here for. I'm here to put everyone together and make sure that everyone can grow together. Well, I, lo I love that attitude of being of service. So one of the things that I teach all, all my clients in the coaching and consulting is always be in the, in the state of contribution. Correct. Because if you could provide value and you can provide, you can be a Contr contributor to someone, then you're going to create that relationship. You're going to create that connection. And then if they have a need for whatever it is that you do, then it just, 
it's kind of automatic. They're going to ask, and then that's going to happen. That's kind of how how you it seems that like you've built your your, yeah, your business. Yeah, and, and I love it. I mean, uh, we've spoken many times before, and and there's nothing like being of service. Yeah. Because uh, to me, money is secondary. It's it's what can you can create for a group of people that don't have that time, and I've been able to create a sense of a uh, fellowship where they do come in together and say, hey, you know what, I do need your service. Hey, give me a call, we'll take care of what you need. And, and, you know, yeah, I might not get anything out of that, but I do because it's that sense of accomplishment that I've put two people together, and I know they're gonna call me. And, and, re say, and refer someone else course, as well, yeah. Of course, and, and they start seeing that, and they start bringing in more people. So the, the network starts growing and growing. So when you talk about entrepreneurs and not taking time to work on their personal finances, can you kind of just list the different areas that you specialize in educating and, and coaching on? Sure. Um, I usually help them how to create wealth. Okay. okay? Uh, everyone knows how to make their own money. Everyone knows that they have to pay their bills. But I think the most important thing is there's, a, there's an important fact here that you have to pay yourself first. Because it's not just to work, to pay. And then what are you left with? Yeah. Half the time you're left with nothing. Yeah. So you, if you believe in the law of attraction, you, you'll always have that 10% to Got give it. to yourself. Everything else takes care of itself. Got it. You don't understand? When so there's it comes, wealth building. Right, there's wealth building. I help them with proper protection when it comes to life insurance okay. and even health insurance, where I get to help them see the different avenues that they can take care of and planning for the future correct in case correct. for their family and for their legacy correct correct awesome. so i like to do that I, I and it's not just to go in there and 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 sell them these products i i go in there and i do a full financial plan you understand Got and it. and with that financial plan it's like they're now they're does it viable. cost anything to do this no that's complimentary wow. the only thing the only thing i ask for is for referrals I love that. So, so basically, someone who's an entrepreneur business owner can come to you and you can basically do an entire financial plan, help them with their wealth building, their, their setting up for the future, whether it's for, for retirement, whether it's for life for insurance, kids. whether it's for their kids. Correct. And you can plan all that and that's part of your service. Correct. So basically, you just get paid on the back end when they get the services on the commission. Correct. So there is no cost the, correct. To, correct. to them. And then we also help them out with getting out of debt. You know, how many business owners are up to here oh, yeah. wanting to get out of debt, but once again, their personal side is so in, in shambles that it's like, what do I do? It's very simple. And in that plan, it'll tell you. So because you have this plan, you, you stick by it just like you stick on growing on your business, you'll see how simple it is. And it doesn't take any more money, it's just how to redirect that money. Makes sense. Now, so if people wanted to get in touch with you, and, and, and learn about your services or, or even bring you on board, how, how can they do that? Well, they can go to my website, which is myfinancialeducator.com, and my phone number would be 786-879-6090. And any time of the day, they can give me a call. I usually set up a 15-minute conference call to make sure that when I do meet you in person, I have everything I need to show up with something of substance. So I like to do that first and make sure that, that they're ready to go when, when I get there. Great. Well, thank you so much for being no, on the show. Thank you I for really having me. I appreciate it. it. Yes. And thank you guys for tuning in on today's Premier Experts. And as always, make sure to be your brand and stick to your goals.